Wait, are we doing two today? Oh, yeah, it's a battle, Christine. A battle. Are we recording? I'm sorry, yeah, drinking yeah. tequila Woo! tonight. Woo! Well, <laughs> yeah, it's going to mix up just right. Welcome Hi. to Booze on a Budget. With the Horror Squad. I'm going to need you to step it up because today <laughs> is a battle night. <laughs> so we got an Irish whiskey battle. We've got Jameson in the blue corner. Wait, green corner. And in the other green corner, we've got proper 12. We all know Jameson's good. I mean, it's just a good go-to yeah. whiskey. Are they, yeah, they're both Irish. Yeah, and they're, uh, yeah. Uh, both I, triple distilled. Triple distilled. This, so let's go with what we know. I, I've never had proper 12, but let's take a shot of Jameson first. Jameson's a classic. It's familiar. It might be my first. You just want me to give you a little coffee. taste? Yeah, that's Like good. that? Yeah. Okay. Jameson was probably the first whiskey that I was consistently drinking at bars when I was in my early 20s. Because I didn't know anything about whiskey. Jameson was the not Evan Williams or Jack Daniels one that was a slightly higher class. Too hot for TV. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got We're doing two, a battle. <laughs> two fine bottles of whiskey in front of us. Uh -oh. Do you want to start with that? Sure. Let's go with that first. Okay. Let's start put this start with the Jameson. Okay. Do you want to pour yeah, that? Yeah, I will pour that for you. How much do you want? Let's go. We'll do half. Let's seat. do half, because we might want to go back and try it again. I will, for sure. <laughs> Whatever you say. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and take Quite, yeah. cheers. Like, I don't right know why here. anybody's watching it's good this. good to be back. Thanks for being back. Smells like bananas. Now, you've had Jameson, right? I think so. I think only in coffee, though. Oh, Lord. I know. So, I've um, worked in Irish bars forever. They've uh, destroyed me. Yeah, this is the quintessential Irish whiskey, Jameson, I think. This is, this is your go-to. This is what we're going to start, and we're going to compare it to Conor McGregor's proper 12 thingy. Am I allowed to ask who Conor McGregor is? He is an MMA? Or... Okay. That's what I thought, but I didn't want to you assume. You want a full or a little? Oh, uh, uh, that's great. He was a double champ at one point in time in two weight okay. classes. In two weight, he's a, he's not a huge dude, he's a fierce guy. He's a lightweight. He's a guy. lightweight and a mid. He jumps really high and he can punch you in the face. He's, he's super powerful, but he's Sierra very wealthy from no. it. Do you get a smell from that? <sighs> I just get a slight hint of it's... Ireland. Do you smell like? It's like salty air. It smells kind of sweet. Green, yeah, and some cows. No, I don't smell Fresh. cows. I grew up in the Midwest. It does not smell like manure. No, these are Irish or cows. Farm. Mm, Irish cows are clean, and so they make all that butter. I don't know. It smells Magical. sweet. It smells sweet. It smells okay. like whiskey. Ready? That's all I'll ever be. Here. Irish whiskey battle. We have uh, Jameson. Everybody's had too much of this stuff, and then we have Proper Twelve. Proper. Number so five. we're gonna start out with a little bit of Jameson. A little bit of Jameson. Yes, please. Why, thank you. I grew up on this. Um, <laughs> Me too. I'd like to tell everybody that this is a proper whiskey when you're um, out of ideas and you're tired of talking with the manager at your local liquor store about what you should probably drink this weekend or Thursday, and you just grab a bottle of it, and it's yeah. amazing. I don't even have to drink it. I just know. <laughs> you just know. It's osmosis. Cheers. Cheers. Tastes like Jameson. It's got a bite. It's a classic. It tastes 
I mean, I don't think you're ever drinking Jameson and saying, oh, I taste notes of whatever. I mean, it's it's very drinkable. Yeah, it is. It's easy to drink. Mm -hmm. I could drink this whole bottle yeah. by myself today. All right, let's try the proper 12. Smells like Irish whiskey. Hmm, it smells about the same. It smells about the same, but slightly different. It smells... A little more on the scotchy side. But anyways, let's give it a go. Cheers. It does smell really nice. And I'm like, <coughs> any of this. Woo, Jameson. Did I say Jameson? Sorry. I really, I'm sorry to interrupt. I like it. No, it's okay. <laughs> I really, <laughs> I just really enjoyed that shot. <laughs> It's not gonna mix well. Are you telling me with you like whatever Jameson? is in my system right now? <laughs> my tongue hurts a little. <laughs> you hear that? Jameson's a hit. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, it's Jameson. It's yeah. good. It, it, yeah. Jameson's like your go-to. Like it's the go-to Irish whiskey. It's a staple. I I feel warm inside. Yeah, it's Jameson. Let's go <laughs> on to proper 12. Okay, so we didn't, so we've got a smooth blend with hints of vanilla, honey, and toasted wood. Is it 12 stuff? What's, 12. what does the 12 represent? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, okay. Let's not be too silly. I want coffee. Mm, it makes you want coffee. Or maybe a Guinness, or, or a steak, or maybe fish chips, fish. Well, it's, <laughs> so the aftertaste is better than the initial, like, hit That's, in the mouth. Did you get a little stingy? Or yeah, it was stingy, but then it mellows out, and it's mm -hmm. just kind of like, all right. Yeah. Add some whiskey. There's no, like, fuzzy Skittle mouth. No, that's it. That's Jameson 100%. All exactly right. Exactly that. Thanks, Jameson. Where you said, all right, that's Jameson. We might be friends eventually someday. Jameson is a safe bet for wherever you go. Jameson is the whiskey for people who don't know about whiskeys or are afraid of whiskeys. You can give them this. I thought that was Jack Daniels or Jim Beam. No, no, I would, I would start with this one before I go to the Sour Mash Rebel okay. Punch. This is a, just an easy drink. And you add a little ginger ale, a yeah, little tiny you can, something. Yeah, really you can easy. do more. It would taste good with like a basic mm -hmm. lager, you mm -hmm. know, just sip on the two of them together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just easy, easy, easy. All right, this Thanks, is JMO. proper 12 Irish whiskey and it's got a blob with a hat on it. I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> it's a tiger. Oh, <laughs> it looks like a sponge. On it. It's a sponge with a hat. <laughs> now, Rocky, this says a smooth blend with hints of vanilla, honey, and toasted wood. So let's, let's see if we can d discern any of those All weird. All right, what do we get on the nose then? Oh. Tiger. It smells better. I think it smells better. It smells more woody. Actually, it does smell better. Do we than, have to? You know, yeah, we can compare them. Yeah. It's a yeah, it whiskey smells, battle, it right? It smells. Yeah, it smells better than the Jameson. It smells kind of vanilla esque, vanilla e. Which, it's more know. complex smelling than Jameson. I don't know if you guys got that. Yes. Cheers. I mean, it goes down smooth, it's Irish whiskey. Irish whiskey is always smooth. No face, no cringe, no burn. Honestly, I can't believe it's not butter. I definitely can believe it's not butter. <laughs> it's clearly alcohol. But it's buttery alcohol. <laughs> It's smooth. It's buttery alcohol. All right, all right. So we know that no one famous made this one, but we know that someone famous made this one. Proper 12. A proper number 12. And I believe it's some guy who beats up people in a ring somewhere, causes fights with random celebrities and young rappers, apparently. Things that Debatable. I mean. Maybe he, not, actually. Maybe not, I don't know. Ask pictures from certain celebrities that don't want to give pictures with him, and then he gets mad and like throws swings and punches, and you know what? Let's just say that he's kind of a hottie. So, so this is the proper number twelve, and I'm just gonna say 
let's hope it's actually from Ireland. It says it's smooth and balanced, but we're about to find out. Cheers. Versus James. It is. Now that I taste it, it is a scotchier taste. It does have a bit more of a scotch profile, yeah. in my opinion. Slightly um, peatier. It's good. Yeah, it's good. So what do you think? They're both <clears throat> exactly $24. Honestly, uh, like, I, I would go for proper 12 just because I am more of a scotch person than a whiskey person. But they're, like, so similar, like... They're very similar, but honestly, uh, I'm going with the proper 12. I think it's better than Jameson. If I had to pick, I would definitely go with the proper number 12. Right now, sitting here at this table, I would go with the proper 12. They're both priced the same, but you can't go wrong with either one. But there has to be a winner tonight, mm -hmm. and tonight the winner is proper 12. Whoa. Yes. Dethroning an old Dethroning favorite. favorite. An old favorite. Interesting. <laughs> Drink that Ooh. thing. Ooh. <laughs> it's, it's, it's spicier than the Jameson. It's like, and then I just pass out on camera. Um, it's pretty smooth. It's a little smooth. It's spicier. It's it is smooth. Like it doesn't have the it's a little astringent on the tongue, but not necessarily in the back of the throat or in the stomach. It's warm. It's got a lot of flavor. I can't so, tell the difference. <laughs> because you've been drinking. <laughs> They're both the same to me. Um, I think that this has a lot more, like going on palate wise. It does have more flavor, I think, than the Jameson does. It's it the is, wood. It is oakier. Yeah, the oak barrel. Do you taste that honey-like sweetness? No. If I had to choose, I don't know. Like, I feel like I have a bottle of Jameson kicking around somewhere, so it's like, if I, if I felt like I wanted to impress somebody, I'd maybe have yeah. the proper tool because it's different. It's different. That's exactly right. <laughs> no, these are so cheap that you can buy both. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to buy so. both to like make but it look like I did. But you have to declare a winner. Fuck. Yeah, I think th this is fun. This is fun. <laughs> that's fine, but Jameson all the way. It's consistent. Jameson yeah, wins. okay, that's fine. They Done. taste the same to me. We don't need to keep drinking. Wait, Let's you didn't up. finish yours. Oh. So you must not like it. <laughs> Woo! Done. <the> Party! Hmm. <laughs> uh. No, you're making squish face. I don't know. I have mixed feelings about both. It's like they're opposite. They're opposite. Like it smells better but has a longer afterbite, whereas that one smells worse and it hits harder initially, but has a smoother afterbite. Yeah, this one hits you quicker with like an alcohol sting and then it's very clean mellow. But then it's already mellow. Yeah. Like and I'm already fine and like, sure, let's do it again. It's better after the second one. This is a, no, oh, this is. <laughs> This is a, a clean, easy drink. There's nothing wrong with Jameson, but I this one's think, more interesting. Yeah, it is more interesting. I don't really think that there's anything wrong with either of them. Now, Rocky, here's the kicker. What? They man? are both $24. Oh, tits, man. So for 24. Wait, was it Rainy or Catherine that said that you can just buy both? Rainy. I Rainy agree with Rainy. Just buy both. Yeah. But you have to choose. But I have, have to, to pick one. one. Well, this one is more interesting and mm -hmm. I really hate the word interesting for so many reasons but that doesn't matter because they all pertain to art things flavor wise I choose this one I agree with Rocky uh, one, I would go with the yeah. proper 12 this is a more this interesting good. tasty drink it's warmer like I have more residual warmth from it but this one is a go-to this is like just mother's nah. milk but this one this one you need a cup of coffee though it's or a beer. Coffee. This one you could just but this probably one's put a in really ice. Really good. Cube Proper in. Twelve might be my go-to Irish whiskey at the moment. That's and really good. And it has good. a cute little tiger. It has a tiger with a crown. And... Definitely a more sophisticated taste than uh, than Jameson. It's definitely got more of a barrel age kind of taste to it. Um, it's still smooth. It's still 
really easy to drink a lot of probably uh, but yeah it's it's good it has the characteristics of an Irish whiskey like it's kind of got a sweet note to it you know it's it doesn't have a lot of the lower notes like the oomph that a bourbon has or the peatiness of a scotch but it's good I definitely would say without reading the front of the bottles and investigating myself that it tastes a little bit stronger than Jameson. Yeah, so I agree with that. Inside my brain, I'm saying, whew, this might take me where I'm going a little bit faster. So what do you guys think for 24 even each? $24. $24 each, uh, clearly proper 12. Jameson is still good. It's still old trusty. But proper 12 for the same price as Jameson is clearly a step up. It's very clearly a step up. 24, which would you buy? I'm still gonna buy Jameson. I'm still gonna buy my buttery friend who's gonna love me no matter what. No, I, I... like Jameson. So split? Yeah. I think we're split, yeah. Close out. Thanks, guys, for watching. Please share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Bye, guys. <laughs>